All right. <laughs> we just got out of the drive-thru. Arby's is hopping. Uh, the rain, I guess, made people pour in. And now they'll, I'm gonna eat the Arby's sandwich and I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna cut across the intersection, basically, to go uh, to IHOP. Uh, so I got the, the smoked turkey sandwich. I think it's fried turkey sandwich. I, I keep getting it messed up. I wanted to get a video of the board, but my phone rang and I didn't know that I answered it as I'm trying to take the video and it wouldn't let me. But um, I think it's a fried turkey sandwich. It's called the Gobbler. I know it's got fried onions on it uh, that you can see right there. You can also see it's got some cheese action going on uh, just to try the turkey by itself. I'm not sure if it's smoked or if it's fried. Now I'm scared. I'm gonna have to look it up when I get home. But it's basically got like a white sauce on it. When I was going through the drive-thru getting the food, he asked me if I wanted any sauce. I mean like Arby sauce? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, isn't there sauce on it? And he was like, yeah, there's a white sauce on there. And I was like, that's good. I don't think you want to put like the Arby sauce down there. But basically, I just see a bun. I see the crispy onions that you put like on the green bean casserole, the cheese, the turkey. It's got lettuce and tomato on the bottom. So let's see if I made this out to be more um, than what I thought it was, but we'll take a picture real fast because I talked about this all week to everybody that I know and we'll get into this bad boy. Now going into this, oh wow, I got sauce all over my hand. Now that's not tartar sauce, it's not ranch. Maybe that is ranch. I think that's got ranch dressing like exploding out the back. That's the only thing I can think what that is. Now, I had turkey for dinner last night. It was good, we basically, uh, made turkey dinner to make turkey leftovers uh, for turkey pie. My girlfriend did an awesome job on it. Uh, we did a boneless breast. Uh, this is good. Uh, this, this is pretty damn good, even with turkey back-to-back -back meals. Now, I don't see how the turkey like made the, 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 the ranch like explode out the back. Um, maybe they put too much on it that's probably the only thing is concerning is like that the next bite like ranch is probably gonna go flying now that i took a bite from the back with that much ranch the ranch is kind of the, like the overwhelming flavor of the whole deal um the turkey itself is good it's not dry um, I think I like this bad boy at, at $9 and I think 69 cents kind of expensive for a sandwich but it's Thanksgiving time turkey's in the air I think this is good um, I'm not going to be running back to get one of these tomorrow um, now if a sandwich place or Arby's had like a Thanksgiving meal in a bun, like turkey, cranberry sauce, um, maybe a little bit of like gravy in there that's not gonna kill you like this ranch is flying everywhere. If they can find a way to do that, um, I think that would be freaking awesome. That, that'd be something that I'd be running for. This is good. $9.34. I can honestly tell you the truth. I don't think I've ever made a video at Arby's before for all the burgers, all the sandwiches, all the like kind of selective things that we've made videos on. This is good. And maybe some Dijon mustard maybe would have been freaking awesome on this as well. So Arby's, I'm going to give you a solid A on the gobbler. I really appreciated it. It was good. Um, the only down part is I'm leaving here. I'm going to Costco. I'm not going to be as hungry, so I don't need the 
pizza hot dog combo and I'll tell you the truth I might not even need either one because I'm feeling pretty good after this so gobbler hey I appreciate you guys over at Arby's hook me up something good next time peace out